Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Sagittarius. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the month of July. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, and this could resonate at any time in July. It may not resonate the moment you watch it, but this is a preview. We get comments below that say that, that this isn't for me. Give it time. Let's see what we got. What do we have for Sagittarius for the month of July? What do we have for Sagittarius for the month of July? Envy. So there's some sort of jealousy here. There is. So I think that, you know, either you're jealous or somebody is jealous of you. This is a pretty, pretty clear cut card. Um, it looks as though we have an individual who wants, wants to have it all. You know, they want, uh, you know, they want to go through them doors. They want that luscious life. They want to step into that beautiful path, but they're choosing not to. Okay. They just sit back and, uh, dream about it, which is interesting. So there is definitely some sort of jealousy, some sort of envy. I'll take my glasses off to look at this better. It looks as though this person is angry. We have somebody here that is angry. They're not living that life, but they aren't they aren't taking any action. They're just sitting there. And you know, twos are about taking that next step from one to two. You get, you get somebody needs to take a step. Instead of sitting there being jealous, being envious, take that next step. You know, have faith in yourself. So I think we, we definitely have some jealousy here, whether it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. Um, envy is uh, going to be very prominent in the month of July. Either you're going to be jealous or somebody's going to be jealous of you. They want what you have or you want what they have. It go, can go both ways. Okay. So let me just move this out of the way. What do we have here? Now keep in mind that Everything that um, happens during a reading is for you. Every word, every instance, every interruption, everything. Let me just move that out of the way. So something is probably going to be moved out of the way. Kite vacation. You may be going on a vacation. You could be planning a vacation. we got quite a stack here. Lion, time to act. Yes, it is. It's time for you to take action. Interesting that I brought that up earlier. Frying pan, trouble, accusations. Somebody may be making some accusations against you, Sagittarius. Dagger, fear, worries, tense situations. This is going to be tense, tense month. It is going to be a tense month. I can tell that it is. Moon, changes in your life. There's going to be some changes in your life this month. Grasshopper. Situations in the balance that require careful handling. You are going to have an interesting month. Barrel. You, re you feel something is lacking in your life. Perhaps love, money, or goals. And, and you know, this one would, would suggest something about goals as well. You can't. And I'm not saying this is you. could be somebody else. Somebody is just standing there doing nothing. They want to have it all, but they definitely need to take action. So it's interesting because it, these cards will signify that as well. And chain. Chain of events that will affect your life. So there's going to... And it's funny how all of these fell out. There's going to be a big, huge fallout. Okay. Um, something's going to be moved out of your way. There's going to be some jealousy and it could be on your part. You know, we're human. We're all human. Okay. Um, or somebody could be jealous of you. It could go both ways. It could be, it could actually be both ways. Okay. Chain of events that will affect your life. Situation and balance that require careful handling. You're going to be needing to really think. 
you feel something is lacking in your life. Perhaps love, money, or goals, which we just talked about. There's going to be some significant changes. It goes with a chain. Okay, it's probably going to be right around the, the moon, okay, because of the moon. It's either the full moon or the no, new moon, okay? There's going, things are going to start happening, okay? There's going to be some tense situations, which it's going to be a tense month, but it's not anything you're not used to. Now, the frying pan, trouble, accusation, somebody may be accusing you, could be somebody that's jealous of you, Okay. Just, just put that, keep that in mind. Now, what is this? Goes from the, from the fire, what, what is the saying? Goes from the uh, frying pan to the fire? Or the, from the fire to the frying pan? One or the other, I don't know. But anyway, there's, somebody's going to make some accusations. And, you know, it, and it could be you. It's going to be a very tense month. You can tell by my tone, how my tone has changed, too. It's time for you to take action very very much it is time for you to take action kite vacation you probably do need a vacation I'm pr imagining that you are gonna need one by the looks of things um, what are you're gonna need one by the time this is over by the looks of things it's gonna be a difficult month and that's the way it goes um, you may be going on a vacation at the end of it. Like at the, and that's what I just heard. At the end of it, maybe you're going on a vacation. But I think the beginning of it is going to be rough. There's going to be a chain of, chain of events that changes everything. Okay, change of events that changes your life. And it's going to, there's going to be some accusations that cause problems. Intense situations where you're going to be worried. Oh, son of a bitch. Um, the hermit. And the Six of Pentacles reversed. Now, this may have something to do with money or a job or a business or an inheritance or money that you are owed, not receiving, okay? And you're going to need time to reflect, to go within, to think about your next move, okay? Some, there's something to do with a lot. It could be a loss of a job. It could be getting in, un, getting your money taken away or something that you deserve. It could be an inheritance or the raise or not getting the money that you thought that you were going to get and the need to re-examine and come up with a plan B, okay? So something is, is you're going to need to take a time out, okay? Now, there could be a rejection here, the Six of Coins reverse. Somebody could get rejected for a job or there's been some sort of injustice. There could even be some theft, okay? Somebody could get fired as well. There's an abuse of power here. Um, there's an abuse of generosity. Uh, there's greed and this is an injustice. So there's some sort of injustice here. Something's being taken away and it's and I don't think it's fair. I don't think it's fair to you. Um, may have it definitely has something to do with money um the high priestess reverse now the high priestess reversed is somebody that is very shallow i don't know who you're dealing with but this person is not very spiritual you are probably very highly awakened i feel like that you are but you're dealing with an individual that is is very shallow and only thinks about themselves um, this is a person that lacks friends, keeps secrets, uh, uh, um, doesn't listen to advice, uh, not very, not very, um, good with people. The high priestess is also an end of, is, you know, we could have somebody watching this that is overly reliant on psychics and tarot readers and mediums and needs to listen to their intuition. That is a message that somebody needs to hear. Okay, the high priestess in, when it, in reverse, when it comes out in a reading, it is an individual that doesn't have very many friends, that isn't very observant, that doesn't listen to advice, and doesn't, uh, uh, listen to their own gut. This is a person that is overly reliant on on psychics and tarot readers but really doesn't listen to their advice. So it's interesting. Um, neat, you, I have to tell you that you have an awareness within you. You have a divine connection. This is a, This is a Jesus consciousness. Okay, this is a consciousness within yourself. Listen to yourself. 
Don't listen to me. Okay, you can listen to what I'm saying, but I mean, it comes right down to it. Listen to your gut, not another psychic or medium or tarot reader. The answers are within you. Just, you need to hear that. I don't know who needs to hear that, but you need to hear that. Anyhow, now this is, this is some sort of, well, this is a lack of reciprocation or not getting what you thought you were going to get from a selfish individual. You're, somebody is dealing with a selfish individual. Page of Cups. Now, the Page of Cups is good news. Welcome, good news. Now, but this is an, an admirer of, or something. And it, or it could be a child. Somebody's been keeping secrets. Two of Wands reversed. There's been a delay. There's been a delay. There's been some procrastinating. We have an individual that hasn't been listening to their intuition. They haven't been listening to or paying attention. This is somebody that isn't very spiritual, that isn't very awakened, that has been uh, needing to make a decision, but they haven't been. They've been procrastinating. There's been a delay. There's been a, they've been restricting themselves. And maybe they've been protecting themselves subconsciously. Could be subconscious protection here. Anyhow, but this is the Page of Cups is typically good news coming in. Um, showing feelings, happy news. Now, this is a psychic as well, but this is your intuition. You're going to need to follow your intuition this month. Don't doubt yourself, please. You have a conscious awareness. Stop doubting what you know. And you notice my voice keeps changing. Interesting. Interesting. Um, anyhow, the Page of Cups is uh, follow your heart and trust your gut. Okay. Somebody's taking advantage. Ooh, that just flew out. Ooh, look at that. That just flew right out of the deck. Somebody's taking advantage of you. This is a nasty individual. Could be a mother-in-law. Could be a stepmother. This could be an ex. Um, this could be, whoever this person is, this person is wicked, 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 could be, um, this is an ex or a, an, an, I just want to keep saying ex, it's an ex or a stepmother or, um, I was just going to say it could be it's a family member. Could be a friend, but I think it's a it's a family member. It could be a child even. It could be somebody's child. Um this is a real uh bitter, revengeful, vindictive individual who is very hard to deal with. This person lies and will do anything to get their way. Now this is a male or a female, I believe. Okay, this could be a male because the masculine energy it is, but it's it could be a it's a it's a feminine card, so it's a feminine or a masculine here. Uh, this is somebody that is a that is mentally or verbally abusive. Okay, they uh, belittle, they belittle, and they lie. So you're dealing with somebody who doesn't tell the truth. Um, they are up to no good. Very wounded, very challenging. I think that you're going to need to protect yourself from this person. I think you you need to keep. It's like you looking, look at always looking behind you. It's like what's 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 this? What are, what are they going to do next? I feel like this person has brought a lot of fear upon you. Okay, they have instilled some sort of fear in you, and they have made you. You know, they've really hurt you. Whoever this person is has hurt you. And you're probably wondering, what the hell is this person going to do next? I feel like this person has, is looking for money. They're looking for a handout or they're, there's something. Because the Six of Pentacles is about money. You know, this person is uh, a bitter, nasty individual who wants to take something from you. And I don't know what it is. I don't know if it has to do with a child or a partner or... Because twos are about partners or... 
what it is, but they, uh, they've hurt you in the past, okay? And I feel as though you are going to need to protect yourself. And I think that you have, to, you know that this person can't be trusted. I do. I feel like you know that this person can't be trusted. And, you know, uh, you definitely need to keep your guard up. And make sure that you are keeping your eyes peeled for this person and keeping your ears open. All right? Um, there is something that is going to be revealed. Okay? It's, this person is very... We, I feel like it's the same person. Is very secretive. They're very secretive. They may trying to delay. They may be trying to delay you from something. Delay you. Uh, what are they trying to delay you from? Page of coins reversed. Something to do with money. Something to do with uh, achieving your goal. They're trying to delay you from success, from getting what you deserve, from getting what you want. This is a, your jealous individual. This you, Somebody is jealous of you. They want your money as well. Now, I don't know if some of you are dealing with a Libra, because I just, for some reason, I want to say that. I don't know. Page of coins reversed. Now, the page of coins reversed is somebody that lacks integrity. It's a dead end. They're trying to stop something, stop you from doing something because of this two of wands. They're trying to restrict you from getting something. Somebody is trying to stop you from getting something. This person doesn't want to work for their money. You know, they don't want, they want to, they want to get it free or something like that. But what's going to happen? The world, the world, the world is an, is an ending. Okay. It's, it's, uh, it's a completion, a completion it's public recognition, learning a lesson. It's gonna there's like a change of residence here. It's completing one one phase of your life and beginning anew. Now the world is a very prominent phase of your life that is coming to an end. Something is coming to an end in your life because that world is the last card in the deck. So it's like you've gone as far as you can go in that situation. You've reached the end. Okay, you've reached the end. It's time for your new life. It's time for your new residence. It's time for your new beginning. It's time for the new you. Okay, so something is going to happen that allows you to leave something behind that you have been dealing with for a very long time. This it has to do with a very nasty individual who is very jealous of you. They're very jealous. They're very jealous of who you are. They want to, they, they want to, it's almost like they, they, they want to be you or something like that. I also feel like you are going to be this. Now the world card is freedom. It's successful completion of a cycle. So it's freedom. It's freedom from this nasty individual that hurt you so badly. Okay. So you're going to be broken free from this person. Okay. But I do feel as though, you know, you're going to be receiving some sort of good news that they are not going to get what they thought that they were going to get. That's the good news. And I think that you're probably scared. You're going to be probably fearful of what they're going to do because they're so upset that they're not getting what they thought that they were going to get. I feel like the success is going to be yours, okay? You're, you're, you're going to be successful here. Um, now, the two of wands reverse can be 
a sudden arrival or a sudden return. And I think there's been a lot of fear, okay, because there is definitely some fear here. There's fear of, of what's going to happen next. I, 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 and you may be fearful this month because you got somebody that is very jealous of you. This person is very secretive and manipulative and shallow and not very awakened. But I think that you are going to receive some sort of good news that allows you to move away from this person. You're going to be moving away from this person. Um, there you are going to be moving away from this person. Now we have the three of swords and reversed on the bottom. Now that is, uh, turning your back. It's, it's, it's leaving behind a painful situation. It's the end of suffering. This is the path to recovery. It's releasing pain. It's uh, leaving the past behind. You are leaving something behind in the past. And I think that... Uh, you know, that hermit... That hermit is going down a new path. Now, that's going your own way as well. You are definitely going your own way. You have a lot of wisdom. I know that you do. You're very wise. You're very experienced. A lot of life experience. I think that you can see clearly that you're dealing with a very wicked individual. And that's why you're so scared. Anyhow, this, this whole situation is about to come to an end. You're going to receive some good news. That this person is... Uh, being taken away or something like that they're going away they're not getting what they thought they were going to get so whatever the hell is going on what's going on with this person five of wands well the fight the battle is over the fighting is over with this person this fight is going to end Finding a solution. There's, you know, it's coming up with a plan, finding a solution, but not trusting this person. There may be a solution. Somebody didn't get what they deserved or they didn't get the money that they thought they were going to get. But there's going, this is like the end of the battle, the end of the fight, finding a solution. Completing that lesson. It's about love because the Page of Cups is about love. It really is. It's about being kind about kindness page of pentacles does it they, they yeah the page of pentacles reverse is somebody that doesn't follow through that doesn't follow through with the plans this person somebody didn't follow through with the plans but this is a, the three of cup or the three of swords reversed is forgiveness. So there could be some some sort of forgiveness this month. Either way, the world card is a major new beginning. One cycle, one chapter, one lesson has been learned. I feel like uh, a fight is over. The battle is over. You're moving into a new uh, place. You're moving into a new chapter of your life temperance ooh, accepting and going with the flow this is perfect this is your card this is you this is when you deserve you de or you realize that you do need to be grounded but you also need to be fluid this is when the temperance comes after death it's when you accept you accept you allow and accept that you know whatever happened happened and you stay true to yourself and you go down that new path and you're in harmony, you're in flow, you're letting something go because death comes before it. You've learned some sort of lesson. You're making some sort of compromise. Uh, you're finding balance, ma managing your feelings. Um, there's going to be a change and there's going to be a renewal. Okay. And this is like finding the self-discipline to change. So I really feel as though you are going to be, by the end of this month, it's going to start out bad. Okay, I think it starts out bad. I do. I feel like there is something that happens. There's a chain of events 
there is there's there, there's a chain of events that that uh, affect your life okay and I think that it has to do with a very um, selfish individual who uh, used you for some reason this person used you they took advantage of you um, they wounded you they hurt you whatever I, that's over it's over I think this person was very jealous there's been jealousy issues I feel like there's been jealousy issues between the both of you I think you've been jealous of them and I think they've been jealous of you I think there's envy there's jealousy there's that's that's the problem here so I feel but I feel like there's some sort of there could be a reunion with this person okay that a renewal a renewal of friendship or a renewal of um, you know cooperating with this person a starting over um, that could certainly be the case but I do also feel like that's not going to be the case for everybody okay that's not going to be the case for I just have to be honest with you um, I also feel like somebody is, 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 the, I mean, this is, the Five of Wands reverse can be an all-out battle. I mean, it can be, it can be all-out war, okay, um, with a very uh, nasty individual, put it that way. But I also feel like there's some sort of fear of confrontation here. Okay, I think that you're fearful of confrontation with this person. But I feel like you're going to receive a friendly message. Maybe it's from this person that you think is so bad. You know, maybe it's an apology. Could be. I do see, I do see the... Uh, fears their fears you know fear of confrontation either way we do have them that 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 situation is over it's over you're going to be headed in a new direction and you're going to be in the flow you're going to be in balance you're going to be right where you need to be situations in the balance that require careful handling so yeah there is there is going you're going to be balancing out a relationship that has been very very rocky this month that's what i see good luck